Welcome to our video on 5 Natural Remedies for Lowering Blood Pressure. Today, we'll be exploring the world of natural remedies to help you reduce those pesky high blood pressure levels. High blood pressure can whip up a storm of symptoms, from headaches and fatigue to shortness of breath and chest pain. If left unchecked, it can even escalate into more serious medical conditions like heart attack or stroke. When faced with high blood pressure, it's natural to feel like you're swimming in a sea of confusion, struggling to find an effective solution that works for you. You see, high blood pressure is stirred up by a concoction of factors including age, genetics, diet, exercise habits, and stress levels. In some cases, it may also be due to underlying health issues like kidney disease or diabetes, which require medical attention. All these factors contribute to the narrowing or hardening of your arteries, making it difficult for your heart to pump enough oxygen-rich blood throughout your body, resulting in elevated blood pressure readings over time. Now, here's a tasty morsel of knowledge for you. There are several natural remedies available today that have been scientifically proven to be effective in reducing high blood pressure levels without any side effects. In this video, we'll peel back the layers and reveal how these natural remedies work so you can start taking control of your own health journey today. But before we dive into this scrumptious list, please take a moment to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click the super thanks button to show your support. And don't forget, sharing is caring, so pass this video on social media to spread the word about these delicious remedies. Now, without further ado, let's dive into these remedies. Number 5. Drink Hibiscus Tea Hibiscus tea isn't just a showstopper with its vibrant hue, it's also a powerhouse when it comes to health benefits. Who would have thought that this delightful herbal brew could be a secret weapon against high blood pressure? Multiple studies, including one published in the Journal of Nutrition, have backed up these claims. Participants who enjoyed a daily cup of hibiscus tea saw a significant drop in blood pressure, particularly in adults with mildly elevated levels. You might be wondering, how on earth does this work, and where can I get my hands on some? Excellent questions. The secret lies in the hibiscus flower's natural compounds, which are believed to have a diuretic effect, helping the body eliminate excess sodium and easing the pressure on those precious blood vessels of ours. Plus, let's not forget the antioxidants that also play a role in keeping our cardiovascular system in tip-top shape. As for where to find it, hibiscus tea is widely available in grocery stores, health food shops, and online retailers. You can usually find it in tea bags or as loose leaf tea. And if you're feeling adventurous, you can even grow your own hibiscus plants and harvest the flowers yourself. So why not make a date with this ruby red elixir each day? It's like hosting a little garden party for your taste buds while giving your blood pressure a break. And, as another study in the Journal of Hypertension suggests, hibiscus tea might even be as effective as some blood pressure medications. How's that for an impressive brew? Cheers to that! Number 4. Harness the Power of Potassium Potassium, the unsung hero of the mineral world, forever playing second fiddle to its attention-hogging cousin, sodium. You see, potassium is like the calm, collected friend who helps us maintain healthy blood pressure levels by offsetting sodium's wild antics. It's like the ultimate balancing act, folks. Potassium is bountiful in nature's bounty. Just think of potassium powerhouses like bananas, oranges, avocados, and Popeye's favorite, spinach. But wait, there's more. You can also find potassium lurking in delicious sweet potatoes, kidney beans, lentils, yogurt, and even fish like salmon and halibut. With so many tasty options, your blood pressure will thank you. Now, before you embark on a potassium crusade, let me impart some sage advice from the American Heart Association. They suggest aiming for a daily intake of 2,500 to 3,000 milligrams of potassium for adults. But remember, my friends, moderation is key. After all, too much of a good thing can, well, you know. On a more serious note, always consult with your doctor before making any drastic changes to your potassium intake. Because, as much as we enjoy enlightening you with wisdom, there is no substitute for professional medical advice. Well, not yet anyway. Number 3. Get those legs moving with regular exercise. It's no secret that exercise is good for your overall health. But here's a lesser known fact that might pique your interest. Engaging in physical activity can actually help lower your blood pressure. Intrigued? Let's explore this further. A study published in the journal Hypertension found that regular physical activity could reduce blood pressure by 4 to 9 mm of mercury in those with hypertension. That's like turning back the clock on your blood pressure, a truly remarkable discovery. So whether you're flexing your muscles at the gym or pounding the pavement with a brisk walk, just remember this golden rule. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity aerobic exercise or 75 minutes of vigorous intensity aerobic exercise per week. And who knows? With every step, lift, or stretch, 
you might just be lowering your blood pressure and pumping up your health. Now that's what I call a win-win. Number two, de-stress with meditation and deep breathing. Stress, that pesky little troublemaker that can send your blood pressure soaring through the roof. But fear not, for relaxation is here to save the day. You see, discovering ways to kick back and unwind can help neutralize the havoc stress wreaks on your blood pressure. It's like a superhero showdown for your health. Meditation and deep breathing exercises, for instance, have been shown to lower blood pressure by activating the body's relaxation response. In fact, a study in the Journal of Human Hypertension unveiled that practicing transcendental meditation for just 20 minutes twice a day led to a significant reduction in blood pressure. Now that's what I call a sensational finding. So don't forget to carve out a few moments each day to center yourself and take some deep breaths. With every inhale and exhale, you could be diffusing stress and helping to keep your blood pressure in check. And remember, sometimes it's the simplest things in life that make the greatest impact. Number one, cut back on salt. Sodium, the notorious rascal of the mineral world. Though it plays a vital role in our bodies, too much of it can lead to increased blood pressure. So, it's essential to keep a watchful eye on your salt consumption. Balance is key. The American Heart Association recommend no more than 2,300 milligrams of sodium per day for most adults, with an ideal limit of 1,500 milligrams. But how can we achieve this delicate balance? Simple. To help reduce your sodium intake, opt for fresh, whole foods, nature's finest offerings. And when it comes to packaged and processed products, be mindful of the salt content lurking within. They can be sneaky little devils. So go forth and conquer your sodium intake with wisdom and moderation. There you have it, friends. With these five natural remedies, you're on your way to managing your blood pressure and supporting a healthier heart. Remember, it's always best to consult with your healthcare professional before making any significant changes to your health regimen. If you found this information helpful, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you'll never miss out on our latest content. And if you're feeling extra generous, consider showing your support with a super thanks. We wish you a healthy and happy day.